My name is Balaram Stack. I'm a professional surfer from Long Beach, New York. I started surfing, picking it up from my brothers. They inspired me to get in the water when I was about three. And I just started standing up on a boogie board and got one of their surfboards when I was about seven and surfed every chance I got with them. People don't even know that there's waves in New York. I would always get asked, there's an ocean in New York? My favorite thing about surfing in New York is the seasons and having that variety of freezing cold, adventurous, snowy weather, getting ridiculous barrels, and then having board shorts in the summertime and having the best of both worlds. Going from home to California and seeing a thousand kids blowing tail out of the water. I never even knew that existed. I was at home with my five friends that I surfed with and we would just watch surf videos and that's all we really knew. New York's got such a crazy sports scene. Every time I'm home I try to go to as many games as possible, whether it's Yankees, Giants or Rangers. So much fun. Growing up, I never really thought, oh, I'm gonna be a professional surfer. I always thought I would be like a baseball player or a hockey player. Surfing was kind of like secondary for a long time and then didn't want to say after school for sports because I couldn't surf. I surfed from then on more and more and more. Even so, even when I started getting like a check in the mail, I couldn't really ever call myself a pro surfer. You know, it never felt like being a pro surfer. I'm going on surf trips for fun doing contests for fun. And one thing rolled into another and it just kept growing and growing. I'm only home maybe four months out of the year. I'm always traveling because we don't get waves that often. The rest of the time I'm just trying to find waves everywhere else, spending a lot of time in California. On the road, Hawaii, everywhere, just chasing down waves. The 10 that I got at Pipe in the Vulcan contest, it was like one of the best waves I've ever got at Pipe, and it was in a contest. Everyone from home was watching, and that was like such a good feeling. That was one of the highlights of my life. In Fiji, one of my last trips on the 4th of July, I surfed for about eight hours, and when I got to the boat, my cheeks hurt so bad because I was smiling so much. The best waves I've gotten ever in my life. Basically, my goals are to, to, to keep traveling and getting really good waves and video parts because that's what I love and that's all I want to do. Being a surfer from New York is definitely more work, but I could still never call it a job. I just did it because I liked it a lot and it worked out. And I'm proud of where I come from. Although it's grown a lot, there's still that same crew that I go home to every time and have the best time surfing with. I honestly couldn't picture living anywhere else really is the greatest city in the world.